Kyo, I want you to try and, hypn and hypn hypnotize me. What? Hello everyone, welcome to a new video. Yep, and yeah, I'm back with this game once again. Um, I saw a lot of people want me to continue playing Penlight and finding some more endings. Um, yeah, I I think there's like some different kind of endings there because there was a lot of options to choose, but I didn't know which to choose. So uh, yeah, the first thing that we didn't do in in our first episode was um, try to talk to her. That's the option that we're going to uh, use for today. If you guys are kind of lost, I recommend you guys watching the episode one, and I mean actually the whole series that I did. And uh, yeah, let's continue. All right, guys, we are here. So we in episode one, we were stuck to choose this option, and a lot of people want, wanted me to do the attempt to hypnotize her with my pen light in in um, that second episode or something I did but I want to see what will happen if you try to talk to her normally so let's do it N no I'll talk to her first I don't need to show her my work right away I mean without her friends crowding around her I can't do this so I just gotta strike up a conversation right be casual about it at least say something first if she won't sir not to me hmm how are you? There's an uncomfortable moment. Selen as she finishes wiping down the blackboard and takes both poor ears in her hands before replying. I'm good. Kind of just, just going to do emotions though. She walks over towards an open window. Eras Ear, in hand as she holds them. I, I can pronounce that word for some reason, I'll tell ready to clap them together. It's almost robotic how she moves in this well practiced routine as if emphasizing her statement. Uh, sometimes I sometimes I watch my own video and I just see me struggling speaking. It's just funny sometimes. I've been laughing at the back. <laughs> but anyway. And what about you? Good, I'm good too. Natsumi to starts to clap their ears together, and the moment I finish my sentence, could you start moving the desks aside? Thanks. I nod and start on my own practice to return as I begin to clear the desks. Is this all I'm going to say to her after all this time? Come on, I gotta keep the conversation going. So, got any plans for tonight? Not so much. What's on TV, I guess? There's this new drama I've been wanting to check out. Cool, what's it about? She audibly sighs through her nose as she puts the ears down beside the board, then moves to pick it up the chair. Some woman who builds a robot boyfriend or something. Nosmi shrugs her shoulders as she continues to move the chairs aside while I left up another desk. And you, what are you doing tonight? I went to uh, in worldly, I can see how this conversation is going. Just like she said, she's going through the emotions. Nosmi may be responding, but only as far as she has to out of a pol polit Okay, that that's the wait word. <laughs> I can see that. She really doesn't give a crap. But I can't let it play out this way, I should. Oh my god, more option, jeez. Tell her I've been learning hypnosis or talk about the show she mentioned. I know all of you guys like the hypnosis, so let me choose that. And then maybe later I can do the talk about the show she mentioned, so let's do this. Well, I'm probably going to study hypnosis some more. There. Well, ask what I do, but say it? Okay. Huh? Oh god. But as I see the eyes dark back and forth in her head, I'm realizing this may be a mistake after all. 
Why do you want to study hypnosis so you can hypnotize girls? That's probably what she's thinking. Oh, you're... You're done for. You're done for. Which... Oh, right. Wouldn't it be far for off now? Wouldn't... Would it? God damn it. She's staring at me. What do I do? Ooh, you're ducked. You're ducked. My hand reaches into my pocket. I sh sure show her what I've been working on, right? I see. But just then the door swings open and Mr. Kobayashi appears in time to spare me from a potential grilling. So I guess that was my 10 minutes. Doc, doc, doc. My one big sense to show not to me what I could do. My one big sense to even talk to her. I docking blew it. I'm in no mood for anything when I get home. I crash into my bed and close my eyes, feeling nub all over. Dock every day. Jesus. Alright then, if yesterday's class was way boring, to today's ours is torture. Alright, I think we can may actually continue playing the pen light. So yeah, uh, if if ever someone out there make a pen light mod, that would be great, I will play it again. <laughs> it's like Doki Doki Literature Club, you know, people doing DC mods and stuff like that, yeah. If they do that with, with the pen light as well, I would gladly play it. But anyway, let's see. I'm just so mad at myself, but I know I have to get out of this funk. I mean, there's no point chewing my whole life down the toilet just because of one massive setback. At the sound of the launch bell, I looked to Natsumi as her friends group around her desk. Did someone say rooftop lunch? No, there must be something wrong with your eyes. Uh, your face is worth saying it. Hmm. Sure, let's do it. Okay. Okay, everything seems normal so far. Since he didn't uh, hypnotize her like the, the episode 2, what happened? <laughs> Hopefully, Natsumi doesn't start any rumors about me after what I blurted out to her. I don't think she's the type to do that, but honestly, who knows anymore? Lunch comes and goes as does afternoon lessons through to the, the to the end of the day cleaning routine. Hey, stick to your end. Uh, crab wipe. Oh, sorry. I as expected was not low we know to me this time, or even in the same room as her. Instead of having to share clean duty with the pink hair bully she calls a friend, and I just have no docking energy for her today. What does Natsumi see in someone like her anyway? Stand. Bow. Once that ordeal is over, our class whip calling the end of the home run means the day we really is done. I'm out of here. So far he didn't do anything. <laughs> okay. I'll get some comf uh, comfort treats at the confidence store on the way home. Watch some TV. Ruminate on the state of my sad docking life. Excuse me, Kyo. Uh, yes. Wait, hello. What is happening? This is going to sound some, but well, I'll just say it. Are you doing anything later? He's dreaming. What is happening? That's what I'm saying. You're probably dreaming. What the hell? N no, nothing later. Why is some something happen happening later? Uh, <laughs> I'm going to literature club. Whoa, do you see reference? <laughs> sorry for the. Okay, sorry for the. Uh, probably you guys probably are deaf now. <laughs> but after that, I was wondering if we could talk somewhere. Talk? Or er? say yes, you idiot. Y yes, we can talk in a s in a somewhere, right? Yes, I was thinking about six-ish meet at the gates. Sure, sounds great. As a proud member of the co-home club, my schedule was always going to be clear, especially for someone like Natsumi. I had time to head home and freshen up before coming back here, but Natsumi is coming straight from her school community commitments. 
so I guess this is some kind of date, but the CEO wants to talk about them. Kiyo, thanks for coming. It's not much, but for her to approach me with a smile and grin me so familiarly? Damn, it's making me blush. Uh, of course, so are. Well, like, what, you, what did you want to talk about? Not yet. Follow me, please. Okay. I have a bad feeling about this. That's a little confusing, but it's how are you gonna put it put me off? I follow behind her in the relative silence as she leads me past the assembled students milling about and into the nearby streets. Several minutes pass until she suddenly comes to a hut held outside a cafe or some kind. Okay, this will do. Let's talk here. This is new. This is new. Yo, yo, hold on. Uh, can I? Wait, no, I didn't mean to. <laughs> I want to take a picture real quick as, uh, for my video. No, that's not what I wanted. <laughs> Thank you. We quickly get our drink orders and set ourselves down at an empty table. So, uh, I don't think I've ever seen Natsumi look out for swords before. So you must be wondering why I called you here. I, well, yeah. <laughs> Natsumi tensely folds her arms as she clears her throat. Okay, so, and this is going to sound a bit embarrassing. But I was curious about what you said to me yesterday. What I said? Mm hmm. Blush is blushing? N not to me. Uh, you mentioned that you were studying hypnosis. Did I hear you right? Huh? She actually wants to talk about that? Uh, yeah, yeah, that's right. That's what I thought I heard. So, is it, is it a serious interest or how did you get into that oh damn what do i say here do i tell her i wanted to hypnotize her should i bring that up now or no this i'll just answer the question i guess i've been studying it for nearly a year it's just that i was reading about it randomly one day and found the well the psychology of it was pretty interesting she responds with a thoughtful looking nod. Okay, it's pretty interesting to me, too. I can feel the quiet smile on my lips as she says that. I knew it. I knew Nosumi was interested in this stuff. It really was the key to getting her to talk to me. Well, guys, I think we actually chose the wrong path before. Because we only choose to hypnotize her right away. She was so confused and uh, yeah, everything went downhill. And yeah, that was a very interesting road. But this time we are different road now and this is going to be a happy ending. I hope it really was the key to getting her to talk to me. Although as our sh shared silence depends a bit beginning to realize I'm not talking very much to her right now. Fortunately, Natsumi just takes it as her, her cue to continue. Do you remember the culture festival we had last year? Huh? I don't know if you saw it, but one of the seniors, Satoshi, put on a hypnosis show as a part of his class routine that year. I was so surprised when I found out I mean, you hardly ever see something like that around here. Y yeah. Oh, I can't believe she's bringing this up, but I let her continue. So I check it out with my friend Sayuri and here we go. This uh, Satoshi was getting started. We got seated just as he was asking for volunteers from the audience. I sort of put my hand up my instinct and well, to cut a long story short, I uh, let him hypnotize me on stage with about four other students and I had a really good time. So jeez. See, pra practice a for those last words out of her mouth and I instinctively chuckled in response. It did, look, it did look like you were having fun up there. Ah, so you did see it. 
crap i didn't actually mean to split out that i saw how hypnotized uh well yeah when you've been studying hypnosis for almost a year you said oh no it's so me no to me why <laughs> i mean yeah it's good for mc but like that's when you were complaining about about you don't want to get hypnotized in a different road i did oh my god <laughs> and i awkwardly scratched the back of my head as i let out a nervous chuckle it's all the confirmation she needs seems i wasn't the only one inspired that day huh she pursed her lips for a moment then continues now to tell you the truth i've been interested in this sort of tank for years but i never thought you act on it until that time uh, i see haven't you put into practice it yet huh have you tried hypnotizing someone well i guess that would be difficult for someone of your she trades off and after a moment clears her throat quietly before speaking up again okay well do you think that's something you'd want to do at some point uh who said i don't want to hypnotize anyone maybe i just like reading about it god damn it talking about this is making me tense up that stuff just fell out of my mouth i don't know kyu you said you were studying that suggestion to me that you're more interested in it than that. Uh, well, another awkward sounds and with a sigh, not to me as again the first break. I've also been studying it in the manner of speaking. I mean, I don't know if it's the same type of study as you've been doing, but I've seen like hypnosis videos, li or listen to some audio clips, you know, things, things of that natural. So wait, she means you've been trying to hypnotize yourself what what, what? no no I, I mean that would be dumb you dumb cute <laughs> yes <laughs> oh my god <laughs> that's me why wow okay i wasn't expecting her to lose her cool like that this is the first time i've ever seen not to be so awkward Though I have to admit it does make me feel a bit better about how i am handling this conversation <laughs> Uh, that's a problem i mean it's not normal is it for a girl to get excited about being hypnotized wait a minute Ex excited y you know what i mean hang on so you actually get off this kind of stuff jeez don't say it like that people are listening i'm not so sure about that but if she keeps acting this safety then i guess they will but, but yes that's basically kind of what i'm talking about and gosh i realize i'm talking a little bit of a risk by telling you this but but i feel like you're the only person who may understand in this town huh i moved over what she said for a moment then the thought occurs to me what about satoshi satoshi obviously i wanted to talk to him after the show he was nice, answered a few of my questions, but I couldn't talk to him much after that day. Why not? Of uh, various reasons, mostly because he was serious about his entrance exams and didn't need me to distract him. Plus, I was worried how I'd come off pursuing an upper classman. I didn't want any stupid rumors to start. So he graduated and we lost touch. That sucks. It really does. I thought Satoshi was one of a kind. She does a brief as she says this, wearing her regret plainly on her face. Then she collects herself and reaches up to adjust the frame of her glasses and she looks across to me. But that's enough about the past. I want to talk about you some more. But me? I guess it's fair to say we haven't seen eye to eye since we've known each other. And if I can be honest with you, I've always thought you were a little intense. Intense? Uh huh. But maybe we can move past that. I mean, you do want to hypnotize people, don't you? Like Satoshi? I. Yeah. 
Maybe it even ex excites you thinking that you could use a satin? God damn, I don't know what I was expecting when she called me out of here to talk, but not this. I just, I mean, yeah, you're right, I want to try hypnotizing someone if I had the chance. And I don't know if it excites me that I could do that. I guess I wasn't thinking about it in that way. Is that so? Well, tell me something, Kiyu. Why did the hip hypnosis show inspire you so much? What about it could have possibly created your interest? Er. Uh, I hear a watch. Hold on. What the heck? Oh, I stopped. Never mind. Let's continue. Er. Uh, because if I had to guess, I said it was seeing me and that other girl up there giving Satoshi our complete attention. You probably thought I'd help you pick it up, girls, didn't you? Wait, what? The, the, that's ridiculous. Is it though? Because when I think about it, I have. Do you wonder why you so badly wanted to talk to me yesterday? What was that about, Kyu? Uh, well, that you see, it's a simple question you don't need to think thinking about. It's just that. Uh, this so I'm right. Oh my gosh, it was a rush to take me someplace so you could try hypnotizing me. Wait, wait, just a minute. Did you really think I'd agree to it? Or that you could somehow trick me into being your subject and and mesmerizing me against my will? Oh my god, finally. See, use her brain. I scratched the back of my head again while trying to come up with something she may buy. Because when she puts it like that, it sounds kind of sketchy. But she just keeps going. Seduce my unwinding mind into a tempore as you could reshape into your own twisted design. Was that it? Although, as I'm listening to this, I can't help but notice the edge in her voice. It sounds a lot more excited than, uh, than angry. I'm not sure how to respond. And don't see me react to my discomforted silence with a knowing smirk. Oh, she's smirking. You know what? I'll take another picture of that. Maybe this will be my tumble. Really? Thinking a plan that st stupid could possibly work? I'm not even mad. I feel like I should say something to defend myself, tell her she's being ridiculous, that she's letting her own imagination run it riot. But you know, you can't just trick someone into being hypnotized and letting you do what you want to them, don't you? That should be basic knowledge for someone who's studied this kind of thing for as long as you say you have. Well, I mean, come on, she's not even upset by any of this. May as well play into it. But if we're really being honest with ourselves, not so, you seem like you do, you'd want exactly that happen. Uh, well, I mean, I guess, but also not. It's complicated. But we're beginning to reach an understanding here, don't you think? I take a moment to proceed everything that she said as I nod in response. I feel myself tremble in anticipation. Anticipation. Well, I was wrong. She's not using her brain. I thought. But she wanted the exit to get hypnotized. That's exy. Effed up. I'm putting a lot of myself out here, Q. No one else knows this about me. Not even Satoshi. God, no. I was not ready to tell him how he excited me when I, what he did. And I can barely believe I'm telling you this now. I can't, I can't talk about this to anyone else. And before yesterday happened, I thought you'd be the last person I'd be telling this to. Or, no offense. S so, yes, here we are. <laughs> Q, please, say something. Okay, so, what happens now between us? I guess it was too much to expect you to take in... in Initiated to test that this paper. But alright. Kiyo, I want you to try and, hip and hip hypnotize me. What? Yo, yo, hey, 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 we can we can work this together, right? Um you're going way too far with this. Not to me, I mean uh it would be interesting to get hypnotized how it feels, but 
you should think what you're doing. You're talking to the main character that f you up in the like the previous route I did to the rest episodes. Did you see how you suffered? You just you just been nebulated a lot of times because of this freaking main character that loves to hypnotize people because he he is very lonely he needs some girls like what the hell just just hear me out don't 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 say this to him all right i can i can tell the future i saw the future <laughs> did i just hear that right if if you want to that is do do you really mean that no, Kiyo, it's a hobby of mine to say provocative things. I don't mean of course, I really mean that, you idiot. Oh my god, of all the people, why did it have to be you? Okay, okay, sorry. I clear my chair and I decided that do you want to try now then? No? Why not? My house isn't f far from here and my dad won't be back too late, so we'll have the place to ourselves. It's a perfect time for us to try, don't you think? Your place though? That seems a little... Have any bad ideas besides you wanted me to take? In... Initiative! So let's go! <laughs> I can freaking spell that word. Nutsumi looks across to me, uh, chewing her lips for several moments before finally speaking up. <sighs> Alright. We took to my house with a quick handed pace as we needed to get here before either of us change our minds. Right, well, uh, make yourself at home. See, Genji Lee follows me inside and looks around the living room as I take a moment to resist what is happening. Okay, okay. I'm going to stop the video right here. Sorry, it's 12 p.m. I have actually to go to work uh, tomorrow. I mean, it's 12 p.m. So basically today. Uh, yeah, I need to wake up like around 6 a.m. to prepare everything. So sorry, guys, I can't continue. Maybe I can continue in the weekends. So yeah, uh, I'm actually recording this in Tuesday. I mean, it's now Wednesday right now, and freaking clock one stop freaking. Anyway, so like I was saying, uh, yeah, I, I'm literally recording this uh, Tuesday. I mean, to, it's 12 a.m. So it's Wednesday now. Uh, it's going to be out on Wednesday, and yeah, I, yeah, I hope you guys will have a nice day, and uh, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you guys want more uh, pen lights videos like this. You also feel unsubscribe if you tired of this crappy channel. I will understand that. <laughs> Uh, and yeah, thank you guys for watching this video and have a nice day. Bye bye.